Okay, so we're on our way to the boat and we are going over there to Black Island. See you on the boat. Pools here. Well, it's amazing. things over there. Stalactites or whatever they call them, I think. Stalactites. But these are dry. They're dry. They're, normally they're dripping. But there's no water on top. I normally travel everywhere with a flashlight. But today I left it in the hotel. <laughs> Would have been nice to see inside around the corner. All right, guys, that was the cave. Let's go swimming. Ooh, be cool around here. Let's go for a swim. Doesn't seem to be any wind here, but as we head out to the, the sand and the beach, there's some high winds. See up the top, it's blowing really hard, so I'm not sure if I'll take the drone up today.
What a beautiful day. So that was uh, some snorkeling at the, was it, that Black Island. And you must admit that was some pretty clear water there. I can't see, so if you see me doing this, I'm just checking to see if the camera's on, one, and two, if it's recording. Because these are polarised lenses, which means I can't see the screen, so... <laughs> It's difficult sometimes to tell if I'm in shot or not. So that that ends our snorkeling tour for the day. And of course some of the most clearest waters I've seen for a long time. I'm sure we're gonna experience more as we go through other destinations in Koron. And once we're finished in Koron, we're going to El Nido and I'm sure we're gonna see some nice clear waters in El Nido. So, um, we also had the drone up for a while, uh, it was extremely windy, but I got a bit of footage there for you to see where we were. Um, I wanted to go up higher, but the, kept getting warnings, extreme wind, extreme wind, and I could tell just by the way it was flying, it was very windy, and I was at 100 metres there already, and I needed to go up higher to get a view of the other side of this island, but the wind wasn't letting me so but I think I got enough footage just to show you where we were sure what we're doing there maybe just a quick pit stop a drink and then back to the van we're going to one final destination back in uh, Koron I think we're going to check out a different municipality the municipality of Basuwanga so I don't know what that has to offer us but we will see shortly when we arrive there but I think we've got another hour ride in the van Another bouncy, bumpy ride in the van that hopefully, with the magic of editing, will be there shortly. So stay tuned, guys. Just stopped and had a photo at the I Love Bus Buswanga sign. We've all had our photos. That was our last stop. Now we're heading back to the hotel. Uh, we'll see you at the hotel. Now in the last. There you go. There. Ah! <laughs> Alright, we've finally made it back. We need to drop our towels off. Thank you. Alright, let's go up now and clean up, relax, and then get ready for a shower and dinner. We'll see you soon. Okay, we are back in our room. I've had a shower and I feel magnificent. The wife's in the shower now, singing her heart out, having a shower. We're going to get ready after that and go down and have something to eat. Uh, we met a really nice couple from Adelaide. Uh, they recommended 
the Buzz Hotel, the Buzz Restaurant, um, the Buzz anyway. Uh, we're going to go and check that out. I reckon they've got some really good hamburgers out there. So, um, yeah, just waiting for the wife to finish up in the shower and we're going to head on out and have a bite to eat. Alright, so we have arrived at the Buzz, the Buzz Express. Alright, so let's order some food. Alright, so we've just come out of the Buzz Express and please excuse me, I forgot to take pictures. These things were just sensational. I've never had such a beautiful chicken burger in my life. This was sensational. Had the burger, had the chicken tenders, just everything delicious. The wife had the, would you have the tuna? The grilled tuna. And the grilled shrimp. Very delicious, yummy, because I was very starving and too hungry. They have two meals with two rice. Two meals with two rice. We were both starving because we didn't have lunch today. Anyway, let's get home. We've got another tour tomorrow. We've got to go on a uh, on the Caron Island tour, island hopping tour. Yeah, get outside here. So this is the place here, guys. The buzz. The buzz. You can sit outside here. You can sit inside if you like. They got like a bar, and then they got the upstairs. Upstairs section, inside, inside's air conditioned, upstairs has just got heaps of electric fans. We sat there tonight, it was just a magnificent night. Nice breeze blowing, can't ask for any better than that. Oh, I'm full. Let's try and get a tricycle and get home. We've got a big day tomorrow ahead of us. So back home, rest and get up in the morning early again. So we'll see you back at the hotel. And we're back. Uh, what a day, what a day. Alright guys, um, it's been a very long day. We're both exhausted. We've got another big day coming up tomorrow, so I hope you can join us on that one. So, I'll end the vlog right now. And we're going to hit the sack. So, thanks for watching guys. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed, click that subscribe button. If you are already subscribed, make sure you click that bell button. That way you're notified each time I upload my new video. We'll see you tomorrow. Peace out.